All right, everyone, welcome back to Smuggler's Guide to XCOM 2 War of the Chosen Legendary Campaign using a better advent series of mods. Uh, it looks like we have our infirmary about ready to pop here. Let's go ahead and go to the map. Excellent. Uh, let's view the facility so that we can go ahead and drop a scientist, a.k.a. a doctor, to look after our squads and remove negative traits where we need to. So we got four wounded. Shadow chambers currently being built. You and have right. destroyed a vessel of the elders' wisdom, and with it comes your opportunity at understanding the knowledge it contained. Well, all right then. He's not happy. Uh, let's go ahead and. New Pick up this intel, because I think uh, we need intel to start making this. Stuff. So, Gremlin upgrade. Blue screen protocol, important. Alright, uh, so let's go ahead and research the hunter's weapons so that we can get our marksman uh, a pretty good gun. Or we can just do Goss weapons. I think we should do Goss weapons. Uh, let's see. Shadow Chamber is six days. Oh, we do have one. Let's start the excavation there. Uh, additional workbench. Uh, we don't quite need that yet. We're doing alloy plating here. All right, let's go to engineering and build items. Let's see, what do we need? All right, so let's go ahead and upgrade our gremlins. Let's get a uh, shotguns going, finally. Feels like forever. And, uh, okay, armor wise, so I'm going to need some advent wrecks and some supplies, but that's okay. Uh, we are okay. Tygen seems to have a habit of scratching that scar on the back of his head. I wonder if anyone All right, sure so is actually removed. I take no satisfaction in battle with those who do not know it and would not seek it. Alright, let's go pick up the scientists. The elders never had any issues targeting civilians. Their chosen are no different. Alright, so now we have alloy plating. Uh no project currently being run. So let's do blue screen rounds for sure. Uh plasma and uh shredder gun. Why not? All right. Shadow chamber now operational. Excellent. New objective added. We are fully prepared to begin our analysis of the material. All right, we are not going to start that right this second. With the shadow chamber fully operational, we can use its advanced decryption capabilities to analyze the codex artifacts recovered by our forces. All right, let's view the mission. Shadow chamber running the numbers. These are the tactical projections. For Supplies and intel is pretty good. Uh, trooper, purifier, wyvern, wyvern, sectoid, mindbender, and heavy lancer. Yep. Yeah. This is going to make planning a lot better. Alright, so let's go ahead and bring sparks for sure. And we're, we're actually going to hook sparks up. If we can afford it, which I don't think we can. Nope. Alright. Okay, and we got our Spark Zero One. We're gonna give him a mag rifle. Just so that we can kinda keep him moving and mobile.
Uh, hair trigger. Extra attack is always kind of useful. And we'll go with that. And uh, just to make sure that he's got... Two grenades. And we've got our scout with the advent smart gun. Uh, which I'm not 100% sold on yet, but we will keep using it. And... All right, Operation Moon Giant, let's go. So it looks like uh, we can either capture or uh, kill. I'm going to aim for capture so we can get the extra... Get the extra bump of intel. Alright. Uh, seems like a pretty straightforward... Uh, mission. We'll move our scout up. Just to give us some view here. Alright, well. Let's go ahead and get everyone in a decent position. Martina will go wide. Very, very wide here. Okay, so... We can blow up the gas station, which honestly should probably deal with most of that pod. And the other pod, I think, is pretty far away, so... Overwatching. Let's go ahead and... Roger. Get everyone we can. I don't want to be too close to that other pod, so... We'll actually hang back here just in case something goes horrifically wrong. Um, let's go ahead and hollow target that guy. And we'll overwatch. Well, we don't really have much in the way of options for that. Uh, what we'll do is we'll actually keep an eye out that way. Uh, you know what? We'll just a regular overwatch. Killzone might be, uh, quote-unquote overkill for something like this. Alright, uh, let's go ahead and launch our rocket. At this gas station. And it just occurred to me that is not a gas station, but... It got the desired effect. Yeah, I got the desired effect here. Oh. Well. Yeah, I was smart enough not to move. So, there wasn't really anything I could do about that. Alright, let's see what the... Act will give us if we're successful. Uh, reduce enemy will, gain control. This could be real funny. Uh, nearby enemy groups will Well, I already revealed myself, so... Let's see what happens. I'm in. So I got a heavy lancer, and... And that's it.
Oh. On my way. That's not super exciting. Okay, so we are gonna lightning hands them. Engage them. The Alright, so there's a couple mind benders there. The good news. This is that I have a few ways to deal with the mind benders. Not the least of which is this one. Now I have only one mind bender to worry about. The wyvern, or wyvern, pulling back is a little frustrating, but what can you do? Whatever you say. Everything here is already blown up. Um. Ideally, I blow up the car here, but it might just. Okay. Oh shit. Oh well. I mean, it was still successful as far as everyone else is concerned. Oh. That's interesting. All right, well, I guess we dip. All right, well, now it's just like a leisurely stroll to escape. Hmm. That is too bad. All right, he's going to... Yep. Solid miss. Let's see if we can knock him off the edge there. We sure can. Okay. Uh... Gonna dash here. We're gonna run and gun here. Then we'll shoot him. That's right. Burning through ammo fast. Yeah, and we'll overwatch over there. That way we get at least one shot there. So it looks like we got a shield bearer, another mech, and a trooper. Okay. Well, unfortunately, shield bearer is still up. over this way. No armor penetration. Take the guaranteed kill with combat protocol. He's in the, my way currently. Hmm. 
Well, you're standing out in the middle of nowhere right now, so Jack Rice will be the one to hopefully finish him off. X-ray neutralized. Yep. Ready to go. The reload. Whatever you say. Here we go. Take a free shot at the Viper, why not? And it was a crit. Weak hit. Oh. Well, that's not a great spot for that guy to be in. Alright, so they should be... Oh, they didn't move to engage. Alright, so he's, uh... Ooh. That's not good. Oh, he's hurt pretty bad, too, actually. Alright. see if we can get... Hmm. Hmm. There's loot up there. We'll see if it makes sense to go grab it. Just put down the the obvious threats. Uh, he's actually gonna fall back a bit. We're gonna crippling fire him. All right, so here comes the anti mech rock. We missed, but we knocked it off the edge. So it was immune to the fall damage, but I think it stopped it from moving. I'm badly wounded here. Or maybe not. It's all bad. Uh, okay. Well. Let's go ahead and have our field medic get people stitched up. This is, uh, not going great. <laughs> there we go. Nailed him. Ammo's low. Right, there's the last faceless. Bravo, you got it. Good job. All right. Servos at maximum. I'm trusting you here. So there still might be pods that drop in, but we should be able to leave. All right. Uh, well, let's see if with overdrive we can get up top and grab that loot. Like yes. Location confirmed. Running. Rolling out. Getting it done. 
All right. Well, this was supposed to be a uh, kidnap and exfiltrate, but we ended up making an assassination mission. But that's okay. These things occur. Okay, and everyone should be able to leave this turn. High speed advance. Go, go, go. We'll do. Like, other than accidentally killing the enemy target, uh, this went really well. Beat, beat. Go, go, go. Alright, everyone out. And that will bring us to the end of this episode. Thank you for watching. If you like what you saw, let me know in the comments below. Uh, we'll be back next time with more XCOM 2 or The Chosen.